The horrifying images out of Greene County were all captured right here on this porch camera. You can see right there the dog was playing. Tommy and Lisa Shiflett's three-year-old family dog named Shiloh was playing fetch in the front yard with kids Sunday afternoon. Shiloh was a good dog. She loved the grandchildren. The dog ran to the side of the yard when 30 seconds later, I heard two shots, pow, pow. I seen the next door neighbor's wife pushing him in their side basement door. The neighbor shot Shiloh with a rifle. I could see the hole in her nose when she come running to me when I went around the corner. The porch camera video shows Shiloh bleeding out on the front porch. She was put down later that evening. The neighbor claimed Shiloh had attacked him, and an investigator with Greene County Sheriff's Office on Sunday concluded, It's nothing can be done. It was self-defense. Self, self defense. But the shiftlets say there's no way. They point to the video showing the time the dog leaves the frame and comes back. The dog had seconds to do what everything the neighbor said it had to do, and, and it was no evidence of blood or nothing on his side of the property. All the blood was, was on our side of the property. The Greene County Sheriff's Office posted on Facebook that the matter was investigated, the Commonwealth's attorney was consulted, and the charges were denied, adding that the owners can go to a magistrate to look into other possible charges. That bullet could have ricocheted and hit one of those grandkids, then what? And nothing can be done about that? When I showed up at the Greene County Sheriff's Office, an official said the case was still under investigation and there wasn't information to share. I would really like to have a full report on what happened. In Greene County, Carly Haynes, CBS 19 News.